Uh, the Vice President, Mr. John Dramani Mohammed, says the government will partner the Soviet-trained Ghanaian Graduates Association to increase the number of scholarships for Ghanaians to acquire training in Russia. Mr. John Mahama, himself a Soviet-trained graduate, was speaking at a dinner organized by the association to mark its Golden Jubilee in Accra. The Soviet-trained Ghanaian Graduate Association has a membership of about 3,000 working in various fields. Sotguns, as they are called, are trained professionals from the Soviet Union, now Russia. It was a moment worth cherishing when members of Sotga assembled at a dinner in Accra to celebrate 50 years of the association's existence. The president of the association, Dr. Vladimir Entridanso, said the best way to strengthen Ghana and Russia relations is to increase the number of scholarships for Ghanaian nationals to study in Russia. I would like to pay a big tribute to the government of Ghana for sustaining the scholarships, for sustaining the relationship between Ghana and Russia up to this time, and for which we are so proud. The vice president, Mr. John Dramani Mahama, expressed the government's desire to support the association in all spheres, Mr. Mahama called on Sotgans to use the knowledge acquired to enrich the Ghanaian economy. I am informed that the Russian uh, Chamber of Commerce and Industry is looking at setting up its regional office for West Africa here in Ghana. As Dr. M. Danso said, unfortunately, as a result of the breakup of the former Soviet Union and uh, it split into different countries, we've seen a remarkable reduction in the number of uh, Ghanaians being trained there. And um, I'm happy that we've managed to increase it to 40 and we'll work together with Sodga to see how we can increase that even uh, further. Some members of the association were honored for their distinguished service. Among them were Vice President Mahama, Dr. Vladimir Intridanso, Dr. E. A. Na, and Professor Joshua Alabi.